Two years ago, a man in Boynton Beach went into cardiac arrest at a Chick-fil-A. A high school student working that day helped save the man's life by giving him CPR until Boynton Fire arrived. New at 6 o'clock, our South County reporter Miranda Christian shows us how he is giving back today. Ed Kosick is on a mission to help save lives. Two years ago, WPTV did this story. Oh my God. <laughs> Kosek met the high school student who helped save his life using CPR after he went into cardiac arrest at a Chick-fil-A in Boynton Beach. Since then, Kosek has been fighting for every high school student in Florida to learn CPR before they graduate. If a kid graduates high school and knows CPR skills, now we have an army of lifesavers every year coming out of our school system. COSIC's nonprofit is working with local lawmakers to make this a new law. Senate Bill 280 and uh, House Bill 157. Seven years ago, we get diagnosed. My Bethany Keim is joining COSIC in his fight. The other half of the bill is asking to screen athletes for heart conditions. Screenings that can find heart conditions like the ones Kaim and her sister have. With a heart screening, you can detect up to like 90% of these conditions before it's too late. This week, the duo were joined by others to talk about the bills at the Florida State Capitol. Kosick says they're determined to help save lives. Or we get the awareness out and more people get involved in the bill and support it the more we hope we should see, you know, success of the bill. We shouldn't just get lucky, it should be the law. On Tuesday, the Education Committee did give 10 yeses to this bill moving forward. It now will move on to the next committee. Reporting in Boynton Beach, I'm Miranda Christian, WPTV News Channel 5.